Question. When this sign appeared, what were the disciples to do? Answer. When you therefore shall see the abomination of desolation, spoken of by Daniel the prophet, stand in the holy place, who so reads, let him understand. Then let them, which be in Judea, flee into the mountains. Matt. 24. 15. 16. Note, in October, um, 66, when Cestius came against the city, but for some unaccountable reason suddenly withdrew his army from it, the Christians discerned in this the sign foretold by Christ, and fled. After the departure of Cestius, Josephus, in his Wars of the Jews, chapter 20, says that, Many of the most eminent of the Jews swam away from the city, as from a ship when it is going to sink. It is a remarkable fact that in the terrible siege, which occurred under Titus III, and one half years later, not a single Christian is known to have lost his life, while one million one hundred thousand Jews are said to have perished in it. Here is a most striking lesson on the value and importance of studying and believing the prophecies and giving heed to the signs of the times. Those who believed what Christ had said and watched for the sign which he had foretold were saved while the unbelieving perished. So it will be in the end of the world. The watchful and believing will be delivered, while the careless and unbelieving will be snared and taken. See Matt 24, 36, 44, Luke 21, 34, 36, 1 Thess 5, 1, 6.